Your blog should be the hub of your social media strategy. I'll explain why in this video. There are a number of reasons why you should do this. First and foremost, everyone should be able to access your blog regardless of what operating system they're using and regardless of whether they're using a PC, a tablet, an iPhone or an Android device. You know, everybody should be able to uh, get to your blog page regardless. So once you've got people to your blog, you can then point them in the direction of your various social media platforms. And if you have a WordPress blog, this is particularly easy as there are a number of plugins you can get to integrate social media. First and foremost, though, you should host your own blog on your own domain and on your own web server account. And this gives you more control than hosting on WordPress.com. So let's talk about integrating Twitter and your blog. Now, there are two ways that you can sync your Twitter account and your blog. You can incorporate a feed of your latest Twitter tweets into your blog sidebar, or you can automatically let Twitter followers know that you've updated your blog with a new post. For the former, you can use the Twitter Feeds plugin. Now, each time you post a tweet, it will automatically be displayed on your blog which has the added bonus that your blog content will change slightly and Google will treat it as new content and update its rankings in the SERPs accordingly. For the latter, you can use the WP to Twitter plugin, which will send a tweet to your followers to let them know that you've just made a new blog post. And both of these plugins can be installed from within the WordPress dashboard, and they're both free. And the same goes for Facebook. With the Facebook Auto Publish plugin, you can publish posts automatically from your blog to Facebook. You can publish your post to Facebook as a simple text message, a text message with an image, or as an attached link to your blog. And the plugin supports filtering posts based on custom post types as well as categories. And again, this can be installed from within the WordPress dashboard. Embedding a YouTube video into your blog is easy. To embed a YouTube video into your WordPress blog is very easy. All you do is copy and paste the URL into your blog post and WordPress will work out the embed code for you. So you don't need to do any coding or anything like that. Just copy and paste the URL and the WordPress software will take care of the rest. And don't forget, you can simply insert pictures that you've uploaded to Instagram or Pinterest into WordPress very easily. So why not do that as a separate post and then share it on other social media? Finally, you should make it easy for visitors to your blog to share your content as widely as possible. And the easiest way to do this is with the Shareaholic plugin. And the Shareaholic plugin basically puts a bar at the bottom of every page and every post on your WordPress blog, although you can set it up so that some things like, for example, uh, your shopping cart, if you have a shopping cart site, don't get shared. But what it does is it means that people who come to your site can simply click on the button and share the details about your site on their social media. So it helps you spread the word about your blog, about your site, far and wide on all sorts of different social media. And you can set it up to decide what social media you want your content shared on, and as I was saying, what pages you want to have shared. So it's fully customizable and you can install it from within the WordPress dashboard. So there you go, a few ways that you can make your blog the hub of your social media activities and spread your message far and wide.